Hello everyone, I am Asima Vishwal. Today I will discuss demand curve. If you like my video, please subscribe my channel Economic Tech for more such educational content. Okay? Demand curve is a graphic presentation of demand signal. The demand curve represents the maximum quantities for unit of time that consumer will take at various prices. As in case of demand schedule, it is of two types, individual demand curve and market demand curve. Okay, where a demand schedule is drawn on a graph paper, it becomes the demand curve. A demand curve shows graphically the various quantities demanded of a commodity by a particular household at various level of price. Okay. First, I will discuss individual demand curve. It is such different quantities of a commodity demanded by an individual consumer at different price. Okay. It is such different quantities of a commodity demanded by an individual consumer at different prices. Okay. Let's see individual demand schedule. If you want to understand the demand curve first, we have to understand the individual demand schedule. This row shows the price of chocolate and this row shows the quantity demanded. Price in chocolate in terms of rupees and quantity demanded units. When the price of chocolate is 1 rupees, then quantity demanded is 4. When price of chocolate is 2, then quantity demanded decreases to 3. When the price of chocolate increases to 3 rupees, then the quantity demanded decreases to 2. When the price of chocolate increases to 4 rupees, then quantity demanded is 1. See this? For OX axis shows the quantity and OY axis shows the price. Okay? Where the price is 1, quantity demanded is 4. Where price is 2, quantity demanded is 3. When price is 3, quantity demanded is 2. When price is 4, quantity demanded is 1. Okay? When the price is high, the demand is low. And when price is low, demand is high. There is an inverse relationship between demand and price of a product. Okay? When the price is high, demand is low. So, this, this is the demand curve. Slows downward. Okay? Then I will discuss market demand curve. What do we mean by market demand curve? It is horizontal summation of the individual demand curve. It represents the aggregate demand of all consumers in the market at different prices of a specific commodity. It represents aggregate demand of all the consumers in the market different prices of a specific commodity. If we want to understand the market demand curve, we have to understand the market demand schedule which I have already discussed. Okay. See this table 2. This is the price of chocolate. This is demand of A. Suppose there are two consumers A and B. And this is demand of B. This is the market demand. Okay, in units, when price of chocolate is 1 rupees, demand of A is 4 and demand of B equal to, demand of B is 5. Market demand 4 plus 5 equal to 9. When price of chocolate is rupees 2, then demand of A is 3 and demand of B is 4. And market demand 3 plus a, 3 plus 4 equal to 7. When price of chocolate is 3, 
demand of A is 2 and demand of B is 3, then market demand 2 plus 3 equal to 5, when the price of chocolate is rupees 4, demand of A is 1 and demand of B is 2, okay, then market demand 1 plus 2 equal to 3, okay, see this diagram. O x axis represent quantity, O y axis represents the price, this is the demand curve of A, where the price is 1, quantity demanded is 4, when the price is 2, quantity demanded is 3, when the price is 3, quantity demanded is 2, when the price is 4, quantity demanded is 1, this is the demand curve of consumer A. See this diagram. O x axis represents quantity and O y axis represents price. Where the price of chocolate is rupees worth, quantity demanded is 5. Where price of chocolate is 2, quantity demanded is 4. Where price of chocolate is Chocolate is 3, quantity demanded is 3, where price of chocolate is 4, quantity demanded is 2. Okay, this is the demand curve of consumer B. Slows downward and the market demand curve is the aggregate summation of demand curve of A and demand curve of B. Okay, quantity this shows the quantity of A plus B and this shows OY axis shows the price. Okay. Where the price is 1, quantity demanded is 9. When the price is 2, quantity demanded is 7. When the price is 3, quantity demanded is 5. When the price is 4, quantity demanded is 3. Okay. This is the Aggregate summation of aggregate summation of demand curve of A and demand curve of B. So the this figure shows the A plus B market demand curve when there are two consumers. Okay, this this the market demand curve also slows downward. And in case of individual demand curve, the market demand curve also slopes downward. This also shows the inverse relationship between price and demand. So these are all about the demand curve. Thanks for watching.